All right, uh, Channel 3, our early warning dual pole radar, dry for the most part. There is a little bit of path, some scattered drizzle out there this morning, maybe a passing shower moving through the Connecticut River Valley. It's creating some wet roads, some liquid uh, on the rain, on the liquid uh, on the camera lens in Middletown. 59 right now. The numbers are pretty good. 61 typical overnight low. We're at 60 in Wallingford. Everybody else is in the mid to upper 50s. Look at how gloomy it is in Old Saybrook. It's still a pretty picture, though, in Old Saybrook, even with liquid on the lens there. Kind of humid, hazy, warm in Hartford. That's not looking too particularly great. Not a great start out there, but we are expecting some partial sunshine by later on this afternoon. More numbers for you. We're in the mid 50s in northwest Connecticut, low 60s everywhere else. Generally where we should be for this time of morning and this time of year and future cast, uh, excuse me, the dew points right now are in the upper 50s and low 60s. So it is a little bit humid out there, a little bit muggy. All right, let's take a look at the dew point trend. You're not going to like it. Muggy, 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 muggy. And then we get a little bit of a break Tuesday, but it goes right back up Wednesday. So it's going to be hazy, hot and humid around here for the foreseeable future. All right, so today is the last day where the numbers are a little bit below average. Then we go a little bit above average. The winds are out of the north this morning, 6 to 10. All right, there's the icons. Notice by 2 p.m. We start to deal with the um, partly sunny icons, so that's some good news. We are expecting partial sunshine as the day wears on. More of the same for the immediate shoreline. Temperatures there between 75 and about 78. And as you can see from the satellite and radar, we do have a little bit of scattered shower activity out there for you this morning. So just be careful. The roads are a little damp, and that is according to early warning futurecast tomorrow's with it today. We start to see some gradual clearing. Breaks in the action through 5 p.m. Then the clouds roll back in for tonight. Tomorrow morning when you wake up, maybe a passing shower. But during the day tomorrow, even the threat for a thunderstorm is minimal. But we're throwing it out there for good measure. So tomorrow, partly to mostly cloudy, I think you're going to see more clouds than sun with a chance for a passing shower or a thunderstorm. Sunday looks like the better of the two weekend days. Daytime highs today, climb into the upper 70s, low 80s. And then your seven-day forecast includes 85, 90, 94, 90, I mean heat and humidity right across the board. Heat and humidity right across the board. And overnight low is uncomfortable for sleeping without air conditioning. Chance for isolated showers and thunderstorms Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday with the daytime heating.